How much full length mock test you had given? One. One. Test series and mocks are. It is indicator. This is the lag in your preparation. Better to be prepared on this. To get into the mindset of the gate paper setter, the PYQs are more than sufficient. This is Deval Patel, the man who quits his low paying campus placement job. Learning the topics of gate was, you know, pretty much uh, step one for. And in less than six months, he got all in the rank. In this video, we'll explore the complete preparation strategy, daily routine, and resources. Let's start with resources. Uh, I also got enrolled into some coaching. I actually, stopped going there. So uh, one major resource, you know, I borrowed uh, some. Notes from my friend. He has actually cracked the IIT Delhi. But uh, by the way, like uh, only his notes. So after topics, I was only relying on the uh, playlist of the NPTEL. The yes. important thing I did was parallelly I took a PYQs. I know which kind of you know all the previous year papers. Where did you find those questions? You know, I initially downloaded many materials, PDF kind of thing. So I think there are many materials available online. Now for some, this is hard to act. Hence, I have organized best free PYQs with solution. Along with it, recently I. I have studied past 10 years gate toppers who did it with free resources and organized best free YouTube playlist, reference books, NPTEL lectures used by them, all in a sheet for all major streams. This QR code will give access to a CSE sheet. This is for ECE, MEC, and CSE. Now let's get back to podcast. How much full length mock test you had given? One. There are some cases like who actually lack that experience of writing the exam under pressure. But I believe you already had that skill. So I think it's a bit, bit less of skill and a bit more of your preparation. I will tell you how I have studied. Every day I was actually playing, let's say, two and two and a half hours. I, I have a you know good uh, hobby of playing lawn tennis. So at the morning, I was playing the tennis. I was usually preparing in the afternoon period, let's say 11.30 or 12, 12.30. And I was preparing in one slot. Let's say I start on 12.30. Then I don't refer a mobile. I don't refer any you know social media. I try to you know uh, get into some room or some uh, space where I, I, I do not get disturbed by now after that particular slot is over my day work is over and uh, i will actually relax with my friends uh, talk to my relatives before talking about the perfect five month roadmap it's essential to understand all about gate exam syllabus weightage exam pattern in less than 60 seconds number one weightage in 2023 mech paper strength of materials a subject which used to ask for an average of eight marks was being asked for 15 marks but on the same year theory of machines one of the biggest subjects was asked for just four marks hence weightage we get from all credit sources is an approximate average not official but in total 100 marks 15 marks official for aptitude now for easy reference this is the average weightage for all subjects in cs alec e mec and civil. Number two, syllabus. This is Dinakar, not an engineering graduate, but an MSc graduate from a tier three college. He started his gate preparation in October, which is just four months before gate. And did you know in his first term, he secured all India rank 128. The main advantage for Dinakar, despite starting preparation so late is gate computer science syllabus is small. Contrast, if you look the syllabus of all other major stream, it's nearly double. That's also why it's difficult to find toppers who crack gate in less than six months in first term in non-CS major stream. That's also why in the second part of the video, I'll share a simple five-month preparation strategy made based on learnings from A, studying the interviews of past 10-year non-CS major stream toppers from Tier 3 who had cracked gate in shorter time frame. B, my interviews with gate top along with this podcast. Hi, I'm Raghuram Chandrakumar, MTech alum of IIT Madras. Let's get into the video. But first, let's first three minutes that will literally waste your gate preparation number one you have to take long form notes one of my colleague at iit murdra civil bag she had got all india rank 127 without any coach without any long form notes. throughout her preparation all she needed was short notes which she made after reading reference books. but in difficult times like when she needed some clarity she referred to reference the book. same any coaching students can do if they provided recorded lectures so long form not needed that's also why if you are planning for coaching then then be aware of the traps of coaching institute as they provide live come recorder lectures for a shorter time frame to crack gate that is not useful this is all idea disclaimer he is a cs tower he started his preparation in august despite from a different background electrical but did you know he completed his whole syllabus in just 4.5 months reason is so firstly maine an academy ka subscription liya tha for 6 months maine koi bhi an academy ka batch join nahi kiya tha maine sare ke sare recorded lectures hi rakhe the mostly 1.5 to 2x hi rakhe so pre recorded lectures over live come recorder lectures from trusted coaching institutes will save a lot 
lot of if you ask my recommendation i would recommend gatewala but i just wanted to know whether all the lectures are pre recorded or is it like live and then it will be like available batch name is parakram gate 2020 so they are the completely live batch hmm. so you can join parakram infinity so infinity batch there are some additional features like khazana additionally 2026 gate test series gate topic wise pyq book uh, they book deliver within 2 week in the form of hard copy if you need any guidance related to your exam or your subject so mentorship session also available and then post gate guidance program and interview guidance program. so if you buy parakram along with infinity you can buy everything required to crack gate in 5 months in less than 10k additionally you can use code rogu 500 for additional discount and pwa caters course relevant to all students so here are the other 2026 batches 27 28 batch details check this out busting myth number 2 you have to give topic wise test even for cs 6 yeah. months is not enough no no i uh, no no i never gave a topic wise or subject wise test so focus just on full length test busting myth number 3 now oh, up 15 20 years ka to at least you try to solve like i am starting my preparation from june or july only or from august with the time that i have i would be able to solve these must be why you don't this is debatable truth is if we study all interviews we are able to find toppers who did it without coaching without topic wasters and even today we find someone who is not from iit got ar one without a single full length test but not a single topper in history skipped pyqs they solve as much as pyqs they can but 15 years as a number is where the problem arises for our Case. problem one we have limited time frame. problem number two if we observe pyqs of any particular topic there will be problems which is of similar type and kafi sare questions repetitive hote hain main ye questions skip kar deta tha kyunki isme time bhi waste hota tha aur aapko nayi learning bhi nahi milti thi out of all the biggest problem is this is jaydeep an academically bright student check your 9.1 cgpa from university of mumbai which is a tier 1 college he's very ambitious that he started his preparation very early from january 2021 for gate 2022 computer science which is more than a year. by self study it jaydeep wasn't able to get a satisfied score in his first attempt in his interview he shares the reason is not having the right direction in second time he joined coaching and with the right guidance he got 93.67 one of the highest marks in gate cs history one of the major reason is in his second preparation he started from june month we used to solve uh, one full month mock Per day. So giving a lot of full length test is a absolute game changer in your gate preparation. Hence, we optimize PYQs. I recommend solving ATS PYQs, but with different variety. Example: If for a topic the 2025 problem and 2024 problem is similar, means same method only but with different values. Skip one of it. But instead of solving PYQs between 2025 to 2018 in that topic, solve till 2017. Now let's get into the code. If you are looking for the perfect five month roadmap, then the next seven minutes is for you. Let's break the strategy into two phases. A. Let's come. completion b or syllabus completion phase 1 syllabus completion i organize this phase into a two step system to follow this easy phase 1 step 1 e clear of what syllabus to cover and when to cover even for cs if we study toppers who cracked in less than 6 months ki maine an academy ka subscription liya tha first this is ojesh verma ma'am cracked gate cs in less than 5 months without coaching then completed masters from iit bombay working in air india limited a crucial part of ma'am success is so 3 mahine mein i completed all the syllabus ma'am first researched in deep of all subjects and priorities completing the high weight subjects chote wale reh jate hain minor subject to aap chhod bhi sakte ho even while my interview with akash a mechanical topper i understood what is the one steady method that you feel like very particularly effective maybe understanding the exam actually the whole gate syllabus is like 100 hours you have to only study 15 hours because from that 15 hours of study you can get 70 80 material science if you don't study material science there's no loss for you if you don't study hydraulic machines it's not a big loss for you now here is where the argument comes in gate the weightage is un- predictable so what should we do the reality we can understand from gokulnath pillai he started his preparation from january 2018 throughout the year he prepared but as he writes i had read some blogs in which the toppers said it didn't appear for any test series and yet were able to clear the exam and i thought i had be like them too. he didn't give proper attention to solving enough problems and utilizing test series as a result he had to prepare one more year so it's more risk to compromise on full length test than compromising on probable low weight test subjects also never do this mistake i come across a journey of Sagar from a Tier Three college, civil engineering. Sagar started serious preparation from gate from start. He failed his first term not because he is an average student, not because he is from civil engineering. Wait, कि maths और अब तो देख लेंगे यार last में 
जो होता है जनवरी का मंथ आएगा पहले टेक्निकल का सिलेबस तो खत्म कर लेते हैं उसकी प्रैक्टिस कर लेते हैं जनरल कैटेगरी फॉर ऑल मेजर स्ट्रीम सो मास्टरिंग मैथ्स एंड एप्टीट्यूड इन इट सेल्फ गेट्स यू क्वालिफाइड एंड मेक यू अबाउट एटी परसेंट ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स हु गेट्स डिस्कालीफाइड ईच स्टेप वन चूज हाई वेटेज सब्जेक्ट्स एप्टीट्यूड एंड मैथ्स कंपलसरी सेट अ स्ट्रिक्ट टाइम लाइन टू कंप्लीट सिलेबस एंड स्टार्ट गिविंग फुल लेंथ टेस्ट फ्रॉम डिसंबर 15 और मैक्सिमम स्टार्ट फ्रॉम जनवरी 1 वंस डन विद प्लानिंग नाउ इफ यू लुक एट द गेट हिस्ट्री सो फार वी हैड कम अक्रॉस जस्ट टू टॉपर्स हु सरप्राइजिंगली आल्सो गेट ए आर 1 हु अचीव्ड गेट विदाउट टेस्ट सीरियस वन इज देयर sir and the other is swarna biswas he actually gave just 4 to 5 full length tests from the gate portal but he was also the first ever gate air one in history to get air one in his first attempt from ec band in third so year so how just this two persons who aren't from iits or nits able to crack without test series after giving a lot of tests i found that if the basics are clear you can easily score 55 50 to 55 marks in that paper so basics in sense are you mentioning about only conceptual clarity or like concepts plus intuition in conceptual clarity is understanding of concepts and intuition he refers his problem solving skills as gate full form goes graduate aptitude test in engineering it is an aptitude test for engineering concepts so priority is on solving problems than mastering theory so phase 1 step 2 build conceptual clarity plus intuition firstly assess when you learn concepts through watching lectures try to understand the concept without deep understanding it's very difficult to solve problems other than just formula based. secondly solve problems ideally pv then once after getting good understanding and familiar with numericals prepare short notes in your own words short notes should ideally contain one liner of concepts formulae some important parts of derivation that is required to be remembered now building intuition had to do more than just day one work this is pure sharma he got all india rank one in gate 2024 cs the sad part it took him 2 years despite hard work and that is very uncommon majority of hard working cs students with right strategy had cracked gate cs less than a year when i asked pius what went wrong in his first year he mentioned okay so in the first attempt only i had i would have given more time to revision and mocks revision yeah so i think uh, so you technically spend more time in studying better is going the first attempt only so after day one work we should do cyclic revision but if we look at toppers who had cracked in shorter time frame forget right how did you remember your concepts yeah so yeah so in my free time i just revise some of the lectures some of the topics okay i am not remembering this they don't follow a strict revision schedule but they manage to find time for revision i recommend the same and since the time frame is less but also we have to improve our problem solving skills make the revision powerful how can we do that and also i would try to simulate a mock test type of situation from the pyq question and i would solve them in real time scenario it is scientifically proven that if you compare how much you learn by spending one hour studying versus one hour taking a rest on that same material you will retain and learn far more as a result of an hour you spent taking a test so let's say you find some time to revise a subject first take some time to create a question paper for a mini test through which one can a solve couple of pyqs b potentially recollect essential concepts and its formula Then set appropriate timer and write the test. And whatever you aren't able to recollect after the test, learn it. If an aspirant for a subject, if he does this type of revision just two times, that's a head start before starting full length. With this syllabus completion phase is ending. Phase two, post syllabus completion strategy. After completion of syllabus, the real preparation starts. Remember Jaydeep Mohre, the gate CS aspirant who completely transformed his gate score. He started giving full length tests from June because the reality is writing a lot of full length tests are helpful in a improving problem solving skills, b revision, c identifying in what order you are going to solve the question. Are you comfortable in solving starting from easy to hard or hard to easy? D. So how did you minimize silly mistakes? uh during your preparation so what i used to do is that during the preparation i used to attempt a lot of tests so that was a rule for me personally in my final exam of the gate i finished my paper in one and a half hours i asked them can i leave they said no so manage time better that's why even if you are not satisfied with your syllabus completion by december 15 or maximum december 31 we must start doing fld's with what we have learned ideally try to give at least 12 full length tests but all the game changing benefits of full length test is possible only if an aspirant analyze and improve from each i find the analysis strategy of ajay very helpful see uh, what was my thought process in the exam first i will analyze about that what was i thinking in the exam and i will open the solution also i will see what the solution was given and then i will compare my thoughts with the actual solution then i will uh, whenever i get these kind of questions next time i have to think like i should not think like the way how i uh, thought in the exam and also i suggest noting down the silly mistakes in the bottom of your short notes in a different color so that whenever you revise short notes you 
you'll be aware of all the mistakes that aids in minimizing it. And after mastering all of the systems, the final challenge is, let me share Ajay's journey. He's from a middle class family, studied in a local private college, then got a low paying job in Infosys, not satisfied in job, hence quits it after two years and decided to prepare for gate and ESE. I remember Ajay told, so I, when I told my parents that I'm leaving my job, they were also not happy. And in his first attempt, 2019, my preparation was really good. I prepared thoroughly, um, I prepared all the subjects, I have given around five to six mock tests also. But on the day of exam, because of nervousness and anxiety, I messed up the exam. And it took a total of three years to get a satisfied outcome. Let me share a story. I recently who came across an aspirant from Tier 3 college who worked hard for GATE, not just one year, but for two years. Eventually got AR1. Then he realized that is of no use to him. Reason after his first attempt, he got MTech at IIT PhD and gave his second attempt while he is MTech. Now, as GATE rank 1 and last year, yes. GATE ke score ke basis par aap already MTech kar rahe hai. To is GATE yes. rank ke through, aapka kya plan hai aap? Abhi to sir, कोई प्लान नहीं अभी सोच रहे हैं कि कैसे यूज करें बाकी तो नाउ ही फील्ड ही कैन मेक अ सेटिस्फाइंग करियर थ्रू हिज एमटेक इट्स आई रिमेंबर वन ऑफ द कोड फ्रॉम माय प्रोडक्शन प्रोफेसर ऑन द लास्ट डे ऑफ माय गेट कोचिंग ही सेड ही सेड बैड गेट स्कोर इज नॉट द एंड ऑफ योर करियर इवन इफ यू डोंट हैव अ सेटिस्फाइड मार्क विद हार्ड वर्क यू कैन मेक अ बेस्ट करियर फॉर यू सो डोंट फोकस ऑन डाउट्स बट ऑन सॉल्विंग प्रॉब्लम्स इन एग्जाम इन योर बेस्ट पॉसिबल सी यू स्टे रिवन बाय बाय